Hey guys, Rack Attack here. Just wanted to do a quick review on my brand new Leopold SX4 Pro Guide HD 20 to 60 magnification by 85 millimeter objective lens spotting scope. Lifetime guarantee from Leopold. Just as good, if not better, than Vortex. For me, Leopold is hands down a better optics company than Vortex. Um, honestly, guys, I've had a Vortex Diamondback spotting scope. I own Vortex Diamondback binoculars. I know that's their entry level type of line, um, but I wasn't really impressed with either of those. I sold my Diamondback spotting scope and was looking at either the Vortex Viper or this bad boy, and I ended up going with the Leopold, and I do not regret that decision. The packaging this thing came in alone was just spot on. Really nice quality packaging. Nice laser cut foam formed uh, case for the scope. I mean, even if you wanna transport it and keep your stuff all mint and perfect, um, that's definitely a nice touch. And it gets better because in the bottom of here, open here, there is even more goodies that go with this bad boy. But uh, yeah, nice uh, rubbers for the eye and objective. They uh, just form pressure fit over and in. Really nice sunshade on it, like one handed while I'm holding my phone. Really easy to come out and goes back in. Really like the uh, focus wheel here on the body. Just perfect for getting that fine tuning done. Uh, nice force required for the magnification, I like that. Uh, most optics I run my eyepieces all the way in like it is now, but on this Leopold, one, two, three, four. Yeah, there's four settings, four is all the way out. And I find two clicks out for me is just perfect. I look through this down my block, down my street, and uh, man, I can tell already, this thing is in another level um, over the Vortex Diamondback spotting scope that I had. It's definitely uh, the real deal. It, it is hefty, I wouldn't call it lightweight, but uh, what a tool to have. For me, angled, angled's much better than straight in every way except if you want to talk about packing in a pack, straight is easier to pack, but that's it. Um, being able to turn these now with that uh, collar here that I loosened off. I mean, now you can basically call this a straight spotting scope um, if you're at that angle, like on a window mount in a car or something like that to, uh, to look through it. Turn that back straight. And then it's just so much nicer when you're sitting or standing even with the tripod um, out. But yeah, we'll get this down here. Take that there. And what do we got here? Okay, yeah, I thought it came with a uh, really nice neoprene scope cover for it. That's basically that was what was in the bottom of the box here. You get a couple more uh, lens cloths it looks like. Nice little guys, easy to pack. But yeah, that's a sweet feature from Leopold to come with a nice case like this. Um, you're gonna spend $1,000 and up on a spotting scope like this. Um, for me to have that is really nice. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna knock all this stuff off here. Really nice packaging though, again, just really feel good about this purchase. Um, and here we have the new SSP tripod. Um, let me get that out, I loosen that, that just clicks out, boom, just like that. And then if you bear with me here, that thing that just popped out of the uh, tripod just screws into the bottom here I believe at that angle you can tighten it up when it's in the mount 
And then here, you can see there's that piece on there now. I just wanted to make sure. Yeah, so it just clicked in. And then just to lock it down, boop, she's locked in, guys. So yeah, just because it's a Vortex uh, tripod doesn't mean that it's not going to work with your Leopold. So yeah, guys, this uh, is really nice. This SSP tripod from Vortex is pretty hard to beat for the money. It's lightweight and uh, it's very versatile in its settings as well. So there you guys have it. Hopefully that video helped you guys out if uh, you're thinking about new spotting scopes and tripods. I'd highly give uh, the thumbs up here to Leopold on this SX4. She's a beast and uh, yeah, if you're serious about long range, long distance and knowing what you're uh, pursuing, this is a tough tool to beat.